Hello and welcome to Point of View. After spending 90 days in space, the heroes of Shenzhou 12 crew have safely returned to Earth wrapping up their historic mission in space. The capsule of the Shenzhou 12 manned spacecraft carrying Taikonauts, Ni Haixing, Lu Boming and Tang Hongbo touched down at the Dongfeng site in Inner Mongolia at around 1.34 am Eastern Friday, September 17th. All three Taikonauts are now out of the spaceship. They are healthy, happy to be home and have spoken to local media. The main 1,200 square meter parachute opened around 10 kilometers above the ground with the heat shield jettisoned at around 5.5 kilometers up. Ground search and rescue teams swiftly located and secured the capsule after touchdown. For the first time, the landing took place near Dongfeng in the Gobi Desert in Inner Mongolia. The landing area is close to the Jiuchan Satellite Launch Center, the site for China's human spaceflight missions. A search and rescue team in the Gobi Desert recently conducted drills at the Dongfeng landing site, the designated spot to receive the returning capsule of the Shenzhou 12 spacecraft. Their return is by no means the end of the Chinese space station mission. China is actually sending the next group of Taikonauts to live in the Tianhe module of the Tiangong space station. In fact, the combination of the Tianzhou 3 cargo spacecraft and the Long March 7 Y4 carrier rocket is already at the launch pad at the Wenchang spacecraft launch site. The cargo ship is carrying science experiments, replacement parts, propellants, equipment and supplies for the Shenzhou 13 crew. Tianzhou 3 is the fourth of 11 missions designed to build China's three-module space station called Tiangong or Heavenly Palace. The first of those liftoffs launched Tianhe on April 28th. The launch of the robotic Tianzhu 2 supply mission followed on May 29th, while Shenzhou 12 carried the crew to the core module on June 16th. The space station is expected to be fully crewed and operational by December 22nd, an ambitious target for China's rapidly expanding space program. Continuing where the previous crew left off, the new group of Chinese astronauts will carry out important scientific experiments and maintenance while building out the space station. The Shenzhou 13 crewed mission is widely expected to take place in mid-October. In the 90 days Shenzhou 12 crew spent on Tianhe module, they created a lasting legacy and a body of work that the Chinese Space Administration and enthusiasts will be very proud of. Shenzhou 12 Taikonauts were the first to dock with the 22.5 ton and 54 foot long core module and made arrangements to make it habitable. They set up Wi-Fi, electric supplies and living quarters which will be used by Taikonauts on subsequent missions. The three astronauts also carried out two spacewalks testing and fixing parts of the space station including the Chinese robotic arm, panoramic cameras and solar panels. They also set a new national record for longest crewed spaceflight mission. This year has seen a flurry of activity in China's space program, including the return of soil samples from the moon, the landing of robotic rover on Mars, launching a space station in Earth orbit and putting a team of Taikonauts on it. What an incredible year this has been for China's space-related efforts. And they are not quite done yet. There's plenty of exciting space events on the way, including the completion of the new space station Tiangong. That'll be all for this video. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.